Now, I'm an ethnobotanist. That's a scientist who works in the rainforest to document how people use local plants. I've been doing this for a long time. And I want to tell you, these people know these forests and these medicinal treasures better than we do and better than we ever will. But also, these cultures, these indigenous cultures, are disappearing much faster than the forests themselves. And the greatest and most endangered species in the Amazon rainforest is not the jaguar, it's not the harpy eagle, it's the isolated and uncontacted tribes. When people talk about the rainforest, typically, this is what they show you and this is what they talk about. And let me be crystal clear here, okay? I think conservation, whether it's San Francisco Bay, whether it's the Redwoods or whether it's the Amazon, should be about, first and foremost, spiritual reasons. I don't think we protect nature because there's new medicines, because there's no fruits, because uh, it's good for us in terms of water quality. I think we need to protect the earth because it's good for us spiritually, first and foremost. However, I know from experience, money talks. When you can put conservation in utilitarian terms, it makes for a much more convincing argument. But what I don't want to do is come up here and think and, and give some sort of presentation that says, yeah, we've got to save it because it's going to cure cancer. No, we need to save it because it's there. And we need to save it because we want our kids and our grandkids to live in a world as rich and beautiful as the ones in which we were all born into. And you know, I've got to tell you, there's a lot of problems in the Amazon. There's a lot of problems with global warming. There's a lot of problems with water quality. There's a lot of problems in the ocean. Sometimes it's really rather daunting. But I firmly, firmly, firmly believe that these problems are caused by people and these problems can be solved by people. But the only way that's going to happen is if we listen to the people that live there and we combine that with the cutting edge of technology and that guarantees a better world for all of us for the future. Thank you very much.